I don't know how to describe it. It's manly, I don't know. I thought, I thought it was manly when I first got it when I was like 13. What's up GQ, I'm with Bill Beckham Jr. And these are my essentials. Always gotta be able to tell time. This is the first little, not the first watch, but the um, most recent watch I bought myself. I've always had something on my wrist, whether it was a watch, whether it was rubber bands, bracelets. You set the right time and the time Yeah, I try and set the right time. I don't think it's the right time right now. It seems like it's, it's a little bit off. I wouldn't say that it's my favorite candy, but Mike and Ike's is up there. I always keep candy on me. I always have some kind of Sour Punch straws or whatever the case is. Like, I'll, I'll make sure that I have that. Um, but I'm trying my hardest now to get off it, just because I really had a sweet tooth when I was younger. You know, I had a couple cavities. I had the root canal every now and then. <laughs> I, I love candy, so I always have some. Gotta have your wallet on you. You know, you just never know what you can need, what you gotta do. Uh, that's the Goyard. And um, I don't know why the blue, the blue looks so nice. It, I wish the red was a little more vibrant. It's more, it's kind of maroonish, but the blue is probably my favorite color out of the Goyard, so I keep this on me at all times. Just in case that breath is hot, you know, you gotta always have some gum. This is essential to life. You gotta have gum. You know, the mint's good if you may have some Indian food or something with some onions in it, you need to get that, get that out your butt. Gum's important. Both. The glide sticks, a lifesaver. I probably keep about five of these in my pocket when I go out to eat, maybe more. You just never know. No guy gave me some decent teeth. So I always have stuff stuck in between them because they're kind of close together. And then it's kind of like a little obsession. I'll sit here and do that all day. Time pass. Yeah. Gotta keep the smell, <laughs> the smell good on you. Um, and it's just funny, this is kind of like, this is probably one of the first colognes I ever bought like myself. Someone got it for me and I just, it's just kind of like my scent, you know? It's just something that, I've had for the longest time, it's like me. Like it just smells like me. And whoever else uses it, but it's just my scent really, that's how I feel. Gotta keep the chapstick on. Can't have them lips ashy and crackling, you know, and being in places where that cold weather is, you gotta have it. I like the little mint, the little mint that it's got to it and it's pretty, um, Got a little vitamin E and peppermint, 100% natural. <laughs> First piece. <laughs> Gotta have these on me at all points in time. You know, your phone, you get messages, you be on your phone, active. I really don't even use the iPhone cord anymore. I use this charger, I plug it in the wall. If this is dead and this one is dying, then like, use the second one too. I always keep some cards on. You know, I love playing Rummy, Tonk, Spades, Blu-ray, whatever. I just love cards. It's kind of something that I picked up. Um, Rummy 500, whatever it is, I just pick up cards. It's a time pass. You know, when you're on a plane or you're in the locker room and you're just playing amongst your boys, so I love cards. Well, David Blaine is a close friend of mine, a good, a good friend of mine, and you know he's always doing some stuff that doesn't even make sense. How, and you know, I watched, it, I sit there and watch him do it. Um, hopefully, he can teach me a trick or two, and then I'll be able to come back and I'll give you something. Big Ben. You know, it seems like it's materialistic item, but it probably means the most to me. Um, a good friend of mine, you know, as my dog was passing, he was only like two years old, um, and he got cremated. They took the paw print that they gave him, and they gave it to my jeweler and, and had a chain made. Um, and this is something my whole dear to me. You know, I play in this every practice. I'm in this, um, and this is probably my you know, favorite piece of jewelry I have. It's simple. It's just something that it just means a lot more than what it costs. Like it has no price value to it. Yeah. Play with this 
No. No but it's not too much in it. And you gotta, I mean, you gotta keep some fresh nikes on your feet. Um, these are the yes ma'am, no sirs, you know, uh, Devin Booker created these and it just, it kind of um, an inspiration from, you know, we, we grew up in the South a little bit, so we were, were Southern hospitality, you know, yes ma'am, no sir, and as we kind of went to other places and we was using that, it wasn't taken well, you know, and it's just something that, that's just how we was raised, so it's, it's a polite thing to do, but I always, I love shoes, you know, I've been a sneakerhead since I was little, and, you know, I got a closet full of stuff now, I'm happy that I added these in my collection, he gave them to me probably just two days ago, so, it's really like the first time I wore them, but, Gotta keep some fresh Nikes. Any Nike shoe that comes out, I'm probably getting. I don't even have room in my closet anymore. There's so many shoes and there are cleats and gloves and all those things. I'm just, they used to call me Academy when I was younger because I used to always try and get a new pair of cleats or whatever it was. Breaking my mama back, you know, when she didn't have it, she was gonna work as hard as she could just to give me that pair of shoes. So that's really all I asked for. You know, that, that, was, that was pretty much it for shoes. <laughs> I mean, you gotta put your essentials somewhere. My bag. <laughs> That's exactly where I put them at. We were in Dubai and it was just the bag that was right there and I needed something to keep my you know, toiletries, everything else that would go in here and it was like a perfect size. It could fit everything. I can carry it if I need. I carry this instead of like a carry-on. I put everything underneath and just carry this with me. Keep the charger in there, keep everything close. All right, so there you have it. This is really it. These are my essentials, you know. This is what I need on an everyday basis, so I'm out. <laughs>